Sean Ray from MuscularDevelopment.com with Sergio Lee with Junior Sergio. We just completed the pre-judging. Looks like it was pretty hot up there. You're still sweating right now. How'd it go? So yeah, I mean, that's that's a pro level circuit for sure. Or or just probably just Jim and Steve making, at that level. You're making your pro debut. How did it feel to finally get up there and uh, do what you've been planning all this time? Right, exactly. I mean, that was the plan. Like, there's no way I was gonna out muscle these guys. So I had to come in condition. And yeah, I mean, I lost some muscle, but. I'm hoping that that was the better, you know, gamble. So we'll see. But yeah, being up there and watching it, come on, Sean. A week ago in California, you were like, I gotta be in that top call out. I gotta be in that top. How relieved were you to the hear top your name? Call out. No, come on. I knew I was gonna be in the top call out. <laughs> How I, need, I needed, I needed to, I needed to be in the middle. Is what I wanted. Right. Not the first call. You got out. that. Yeah, I did. And <laughs> come on, you know bodybuilding. What do you mean? They don't know how they feel. I mean, how relieved were you? I was pretty relieved. I'll, I'll, be, I'll tell you how relieved I am tonight. Well, I know, because now you're in the pressure cooker because you got a few hours to burn and you got to get back up there, do it all again. What do you got to do between now and tonight? Yeah, see, I feel like it's only going to help me because I'm only going to dry out better. I should only get harder. But, yeah, you do nothing. That's exactly what you do. And right now, as, as uh, Bob Chicarello would say, you just land the plane. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to not fuck it up. Do you go, do you pose? Are you looking at yourself in the mirror? Are you just kind of laying down? Or are you no, I'm going to rest for sure. And then I'm going to try and you know, maybe push some more water out, of course. But this is the East Coast. This is, this is Della Rosa's neighborhood. Right. <laughs> if I don't show up tonight way better than I was this morning, then it doesn't matter. And, he's, and he deserves it to win. Well, you said I asked you what a victory would be, and you said to be first or second. So you're, it looks like you're going to be in the hunt for that. But now, can you taste the victory? I mean, are you looking for number one instead of just being first or second? I mean, yeah. You want to win this? No, no, I don't want to win. Sure. <laughs> you, were, you weren't that confident a week ago. That's why I'm trying to. How confident are you now that you've actually gone through the prejudging? You've got more confidence because of it? Yeah. John was the guy, or was it not Kim that you were thinking about when you got to this type of doubt? No, I actually was not thinking of either one of them, and I'll tell you the truth. I really think that Sasan gets screwed a lot of shows because really this this show should have been condition and body parts that are lagging in, in bodybuilding right now, like legs. And I feel like the only person I was thinking about the whole time was the one no one was talking about, which was Sasan. And I don't know. I felt like this guy doesn't really get his justice. so. Standing next to who I ended up getting in that first call out with, yeah, I felt more confident, absolutely. But uh, I was not worried about a king. Yeah, it's just too big, too heavy. Yeah, I mean, I, it's, it's he was not, the biggest guy up there. For sure, he's the biggest. He's a he could be the biggest guy at the Olympia, you know, pound wise, absolutely. But hopefully tonight we'll find out that that doesn't mean shit. All right, well, this show's going to be one and lost on condition. In a few short hours, we'll find the faith of Sergio Oliva Jr. making his pro debut here in White Plains, New York. From MuscularVelvet.com, I'm Sean Ray.